Okay, so far, this giant bag of chips and snacks. And then this, the bag on the outside's wet because a bottle of degreaser spilled all over it. But the stuff inside's okay. There's some Cheez-Its and some, looks like lemon juice. Um, and then, open this up, baby. There's some brooms, some potty mix. Some cat food, looks like some charcoal, uh, there's a dustpan with the broom, so uh, we're going to lift all this up and see what all we can find. Wish us luck. Okay, those few things that we saw turned into a carload. Two brooms, three dustpans, this bag of, of snacks, this bag of snacks, all kinds of clothes, more snacks, clothes, more snacks, uh, two bags of cat food, one bag of um, potting soil, um, this sprayer, case of water, a few little odds and ends, uh, and several bags that we just don't even know what is in yet. Um, we were just throwing them in. Um, so products, clothes, food. The dumpster was absolutely full and we got it all. Um, sweating like a pig out here in this humidity. Uh, there's some charcoal, but we got it. And now we're over here, this discount store, whatever that is, still in its zippered up pouch, we're getting it. We'll find out when we get home. There's an oscillating fan. It looks like some kind of comforter or something. So I've got some digging to do here. Wish me luck. This um, dumpster's covered in barbecue sauce inside and out. It smells better than most we've been in. Okay, um, my daughter is gonna film for me while I pull everything out. So what we've got so far is um, this oscillating fan. Looks like it's got a price tag of $30 on it. It seems to be um, intact, ported there, a little bit owner's manuals in there. In its box, I'm assuming it was either a demonstration or a customer return. Normally, there is a tag or they write on it that says damaged or return, and it doesn't say anything. Then what I thought was a comforter is a king size mattress pad. It's a $16.99 price on it. Um, we'll donate that. Um, there's that sprayer, which we have one. We'll see if uh, my husband needs it. If not, we'll donate that. Um, this little tripe will go to the women's shelter. And then this, turns out, it is a canopy base. It's the middle frame. The top doesn't appear to be there. Now, in our yard sale, our canopy was destroyed. So we have the top from that canopy. Um, so that is working out just perfect. You know, the universe just takes care of me. Um, so what we're going to do is just pull everything out of here and then let you see it as we pull it out. And um, the reason why I didn't have gloves on before is because my gloves were buried and my bags are buried. And so we just threw everything in. And um, now we'll try to sort it kind of as we go out. So we've got lots of little clothes out. This is a whole outfit, still got tags on it. Um, we'll have to wash it out because um, it's rained and things just were actually in the rain at the bottom of that dumpster. So it's gonna be a lot of clothes that just need to be washed um, before we can donate them. And they will probably just go to that same women's shelter that we just dropped off the other stuff from. Um, these things are kind of tangled, so I'm going to take these to the hanger for that. Um, looks like a pair of sweats, stars, those will fit either me or my daughter, one or the other. Um, that is a pair of the lure shorts probably that went to some kind of jammas. There's a bathrobe. Bobby Brooks bathrobe. 
Very nice. And there's another two-piece set with the little shorts and the basketball top. And there's a little pair of shorts with a little skirt. And there's another top with the shorts. Boy. That looks like a pair of shorts that will fit my daughter if she wants them, little running shorts. And if not, they'll be donated. And that looks like a sports bra. We've even we got toilet paper here, guys. <laughs> There's one of the um, O Cedar. Dust pans. I think there were three all total. There's another um, short set. Just like the other two. And one more short set. And I think there was one other one like that. Looks like a lip gloss and some earrings. There's another little pair of two T shorts. How cute! And this is one of those straps that goes over your um, seat belt to keep them from rubbing you. I'm gonna put that in to be washed. There's our two new uh, O-Cedar brooms. I don't see a thing wrong with them. They threw away the display, the brooms, the dustpans. They were all in there. And, you know, you can always use a new broom. you got to use a new broom, right? There's another one of the dustpans. And there's another one of the dustpans. There's some fabric refreshener. Just always use that. Don't see a thing wrong with that. There's some Tresemme hairspray. Completely full. Nothing wrong with it. You know, I don't think there's expiration dates on cleaners and hairspray. <laughs> but yeah, here's a bottle of Ajax. And we've got some green tea. Um, expires May of 2021. It's got a dent in it, and I'm assuming that's why they got rid of it. And we've got a lot of bottled water. There was a case, and of course, I'll spill that the case. Um, there's some Hershey's Cookie Layer Crunch Triple Chocolate, and then there's some tortilla chips. And there's a pack of potting soil. That will be for that. Another pack of kit and caboodle. Um, expires 625 of 19, so that's why it was thrown out. Because there's some Ooh. Fruity Pebbles treats. Oh, <laughs> my daughter's eyes just went. <laughs> okay, we got an entire case of these uh, ripple cut chips. And I was just thinking how we need to find just some regular chips. Here's some charcoal. So these chips are out of their box because the box has got wet. So we had to you know, pull them all out and throw them in the car. We even got 
two rolls of toilet paper. Who doesn't need that, right? And there's a little mini water bottle. Chips. And this we found already. It's just still in the car because the church is having a yard sale and we're going to donate it to the church's yard sale. Um, we like to do things like that. It just benefits the church. Um, everybody brings all of their stuff that they don't want. The church has a big yard sale. And they get to keep the money. This is the bag that got wet on the outside, but it is perfectly fine on the inside. There's some Cheez-Its White Cheddar. And it says a four-pack, so it's just a little snack size. Honey barbecue, yeah, buddy. You know, hubby spends money on these things, so I like to find them and then we don't have to spend the money. There's some honey nut Cheerios. There's some men's boxers. Uh, 2XL, those would be donated because nobody in my house can wear that size. With the clothes. And then we have got lemon juice. One. Two, let's put those in place. Three, four, five bottles of lemon juice. And then this sticky bag, um, some degreaser cleaner spilled out on top of it. That's why that's all sticky. And then this bag, I don't think I'm going to open out here, but I'm going to show you. There's a four pack of the uh, Fudge Stripe Minis. One, two of those. They're triple cut chips. And ah, uh, Takis, so that's my son's favorite. Nacho cheese, cookie chips, they will like that. There's ranch, you know. Like I said, I'm always just putting my order in for the universe and we find it. And I was saying, we need to find some other chips because hubby's getting tired of the uh, corn chips that we had and tortilla chips. They were just plain. So, yeah, these are all the flavors that they like. So, that's perfect. And I'm just going to carry this whole thing into the house. Now, if we go around to the side of the car and you can see how humid it is. Look at my face, guys. I'm just dripping with sweat, and that's how we were pulling the stuff out of the dumpster, too. Okay. We've got some little kids' underwear, and that might be ladies, I don't know. That one packed, but I know those are little kids. Oops, I just dropped something out. There's a 3X um, shirt, which, you know, I would sleep in that. I'd use that as a nightdress. Nothing wrong with using that as a nightdress. Um, there's our case of water. Here's some sweatpants that are extra large. I sleep in those with a little hat. There's new jammies. There we go. Um, there's a paring knife. All purpose uh, soft contact lens solution. And doesn't expire until 5 of 2020. So that can go to the women's shelter. Um, toilet bowl cleaner. I was just saying I needed some more of that. <laughs> There's some Tylenol PM. Um, doesn't expire until 5 of 20, so that's still good. There's some Oreos chocolate candy bar. Contains hazelnut paste. Never heard of it, never saw it, but I'm sure the kids will love trying that out. There's a pack of corn tortillas, which even if they're stale, are good for making um, enchiladas. 7-Eleven uh, of 19. Not expired yet. Still good. And some index cards, and then some Dove chocolate, and those are individually sealed, even though the outside package is open. Um, and some panty liners. 
These are some little doodads that just stick down in the yard. We like and stuff like that. Um, there's another pair of sweatpants. Extra large. Those will fit me. These will fit my daughter. There we go. Okay. And this is a uh, part of that case of water. We just found a bag and some more of them. This, I don't know if you can see it, but there's a watermelon. <laughs> and that came from a different store, and that was all we found in the grocery store. This bag, I just grabbed the whole bag, so there's probably trash in there, so yeah, that's trash. Grab the whole bag and just ran with it. That's trash. There's a little pair of shorts. That's where that, um, yeah, that needs to be washed. What's they need to be washed anyway? There's some size large sweatpants. Those will fit me or my daughter. Um, and that, um, good rate, spill on it. Uh, there's a sprayer bottle without the top sprayer, which that's fine. We've got those. And some fly traps, always good for summer. A box of a zero calorie sweetener. Some Miracle Whip. Um, doesn't expire until November 11th of 19, so that's still good. Don't know why they threw it out. There's some famous Amos cookies. Kids will like those. Oh, it's open. Open and fall out. So. That's cotton candy body scrub. There we go. really wish I had a free hand to wipe some of the sweat off me. <laughs> Here's a cute little bottle. Um, two of these, um, let me get it out of the bag. Little hooks that you put in the ground and hang stuff in your yard. We, we love stuff. this and that's the stake and then there's the uh, solar unit and then something goes at the top and I found the top I don't know where it is but it's like a ball of um, mosaic glass that sits on there so even if it doesn't light up it's still real cute for the yard and there's one little solar light Swiffer wet jet, which we actually found a Swiffer wet jet in this same dumpster. So this will go to them. So that was our gigantic haul from one dumpster. And yes, everything had got wet because we've had a lot of rain lately and all this humidity. Um, but it was a pretty good score. So we had a great day and we thank you for watching. And please do subscribe and tick that little bell so you get the notifications. Bye.